Press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update from ESPN Crick and Phone. From a personal point of view, um, I'm ecstatic. I'm really excited for the team. Um, yes, it's it's good to put a, a personal performance on the board, but I'm I'm really excited in the way that Australian cricket's heading. Um, the way we prepared for this game, the the way that we, you know, we did our research on the players, um, everything leading up to this game, I felt um, was absolutely perfect, and and obviously the result tonight was was ideal. Yeah, I, I was actually. Um, Probably a little bit disappointed where the where the ball came out. Um, probably bowled it a little bit too straight, but luckily enough had a fielder there um, that hung on to it. Uh, Marcus Thorne has hung on to it, so it's probably a wicket I'll remember for a very long time. Yeah, look, it was a really good wicket, um, and we understood that you know it probably wasn't the quickest wicket in the world. Um, so we knew when the ball got a little bit softer later in the innings that when we turned to slower balls and, and change of pace, um, that it was going to be quite effective. And we saw that um, at the end there. Everyone changed their pace really well and, and got a few wickets with that. Um, yeah, we thought it was a competitive score, and obviously 280 is a competitive score. Um, there's a few larger pockets um, around the ground, so there's a few long boundaries, and, and I think we actually bowled well um, according to that tonight. Yeah, look, he batted really well. Um, credit to him, he, he summed up the conditions just as well as we did. Um, batted very patiently and, and knew the balls that he could put away and, and he picked the gaps um, really well tonight. And, you know, there was a period there, they had a partnership through the middle um, and almost, you know, could have taken the game away from us, but we were, we were lucky to get Donny out um, LBW and, and, you know, we, we kept getting wickets from there. So, look, I, he was very dangerous and we understood that. Um, so our, our plan sort of changed to, to sort of get him off strike and, and just bowled the other batsman down the other end. Yeah, definitely. Obviously, um, when you have a series like that, then all you can do is learn and, and learn how to get better. Um, like I said before, our preparation um, leading up to this game was absolutely phenomenal. Um, everyone trained with, with great intensity. We had a, had a really tough session during the week um, that got everyone up and about. Um, and everyone was really excited to play this game. Everyone was really excited to, to get into the retro kits. Um, and I think, I know it's such a small thing being in this, um, this uniform, but it, it just creates a nice positive um, sort of feel around the group. Everyone's really excited to get it on and, and throws a few flashbacks in there. So, yeah, there's very good. Yeah, definitely. Um, I'm learning every day. I'm learning more and more about my game every day. Um, Really enjoyed being back in WA to be able to play um, probably a fair bit more cricket than I have last year. Played played some Shield games and obviously started off in the Big Bash. Um, just to get the, the amount of cricket that I've played under my belt um, has been ideal. It Just in that learning process, just, just being able to, to really hone in on my skills and, and know what I'm good at and learn what I'm good at. So when it comes to next year, obviously... Obviously, as a long-term goal, it would be great to get there, um, but my, my focus purely is on these next two games. Well, it, it's, it's a dream. Um, I would love to play an Ashes Tour. Um, I think, obviously, if I keep going well, then nothing's out of the question, but uh, as I said, my focus is, is here and now, and, and we'll go from there. Yeah, it's a question I get a lot. Um, when I was younger, obviously, a lot of people told me that I wasn't going to be a fast bowler. Um, that's just reality, you know. We saw a, a lot of big, tall, strong, fast bowlers and I've always liked to think of myself as um, not better or worse, just different. Um, and, and I think with that, it, it might, you know, on certain wickets, uh, wickets that aren't bouncing, I guess being a little bit shorter might get the ball to skid through a little bit more. Um, those sorts of little things, uh, yeah, like I said, I don't think it's better or worse, just different. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe and leave your comments in the comment section below. Click on the bell icon for notifications.